Hello Taurus, welcome to your daily reading. I hope you're having a wonderful weekend so far and looking forward to a bright new week ahead. So straight up we have the Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords is some fast moving energy that is, it looks like it's actually leaving your experience as opposed to coming towards you because it's going out of your spread and it's coming from a place of imbalance. So you may have been multitasking or doing too much all at once and it kind of made you lose your equilibrium in life <clears throat> excuse me for a little while knight of cups is telling me that there is someone a romantic around you that you may be moving towards we have death which is scorpio energy could be this knight of cups is scorpio however death with this knight of swords a very quick ending um, is uh, you know basically something that you feel that you need to do in order to um, tackle this multitasking now six of cups is memories of love reminiscing thinking of someone fondly um, it could be to do with this knight of cups you and this knight of cups have happy memories together you have made a lot of happy times in the past perhaps and maybe they're re-emerging because six of cups is a lot to do with our past and our mem memories however you know it's it's really us going back in time thinking about this Knight of Cups or this Knight of Cups could be thinking about you. Could be this Knight of Cups is going to give you a gift because Six of Cups is also the giving and receiving of lovely gifts. Feeling a bit sad in regards to whatever this ending was here. It's a fast ending, a matter of days, okay, whether it's already happened because this is a generally the past energy and this is the future energy and this is neutral, meaning now. Right now, we're still multitasking and we're going through this ending, going into this beautiful soulmate give and take, um, lovely thinking of each other vibe but there is some sadness that you've had to deal with. It wasn't an easy decision. This is uh, Libra with the moon using our intuition in regards to this difficult decision. However, you know, because it's Libra, it's really about finding out balance again in regards to whatever was imbalanced, okay? It's also not an easy choice to make. However, we're making it wonderful temperance is Sagittarius energy and I think I already said death is Scorpio um, temperance is really about finding our balance again this person whoever this knight of cups is uh, is balancing us out okay they make us feel so much better it's like I feel myself again that's really nice Taurus who is this person we have the wheel of fortune this situation of ending something even though it was a difficult decision and has caused some sadness and maybe even some regret uh, the wheel of fortune is really about we're going to make some big changes in regards to the the direction that we're going and it's upright indicating positive changes at that Ooh, two of cups that's beautiful with the six of cups you've got a lot of cups and even temperance is pouring cups around this night there's a lot of love and a lot of feeling and a lot of zen peace harmony in regards to this knight of cups whoever they are they're going to bring a lot of happiness and improvement and emotional fulfillment and you feel a soulmate vibe already around them and it's really beautiful whether they're in your experience now or they're yet to come Ooh, building growing developing and expanding for some of you i'm getting the vibe this is somebody else uh just for some of you maybe you didn't know them for very long but you may be moving through their energy and just it, it toppled you over a little bit uh, but you're moving into something else just for some of you um so four of wands it's expanding 
and growing and there is possibly for some of you a job or if you're in a business this business is going to grow and expand and you're getting some clients and customers coming towards you some others of you um, this is really about being accepted for a job if you have been applying this is good news it's a sign that you're going to get it uh, for others of you this is business improvements it could be um you know, a pay, pay rise because it's about expansion and Page of Pentacles is helping your pentacles expand. Uh, Four of Pentacles is a sign that whatever it is that is growing and expanding in regards to work to hold on to it and to not let it go also it could very well be saving for a rainy day king of wands could be your new boss could also be this knight of cups you know um kind of starting to dominate the energy around you because the night king of wands is someone very dominant could be a fire sign aries leo sagittarius perhaps this king is giving you something to hold on to like you know you have the the gift giving vibes with the six of cups and perhaps the page of pentacles is a gift that they want you to hold on to with four of uh pentacles because they want this relationship to grow develop and expand all right Taurus next up I'm going to do your Lenormand and see what the vibes are in regards to this situation Ooh, did you see that we've got the lover is a loyal friend at the moment or the lover is loyal and you can trust them so if, you, if you've been asking you can trust this person Ooh, snake um now Snake uh, has a couple of different meanings, owls and house. So for some of you, okay, this is a really personal message. Your person may be undergoing uh, therapy for anger management. Just saying that's just uh, some of you. Uh, if it's not anger management, so they may be talking to you about how they feel, you know, and, you know, if it is the anger management thing, it's monthly cycles with the moon. That's a really personal message for some of you. Um, so this lover here, he might be on the jealous side um, and he might need some soothsaying on your part in regards to to calming him down if he thinks that you're out there mingling with other people okay because a snake shows up as uh yeah it can be a bit of a jealous streak in him if it's not jealousy it just means that he's very passionate and focused on you because the snake is focused before they strike so it's a focus and he wants to kind of get your attention with um the owls it could be that he's using the fact that he's a good communicator and he's very wise because the owls are wise and he's great at um giving advice a very sharp minded in regards to guidance and advice for some of you home and uh, the moon is very comfortable cozy and romantic and emotionally connected the house could indicate that they live around your home they want to visit your home could be that they're buying a new home but there's no real symbol saying that he wants to buy a home around you or he's moving in it's more so saying that he's someone very stable okay what else is there the key to a home that would be the first symbol that he's buying a home or moving in a home he may be making some decisions and he might tell you when you meet at the garden or you meet somewhere in a public place that he's making some decisions in regards to relocating for some of you coming yeah this is literally to tell you that he loves you wow taurus how amazing is that and now i'll do your personal messages and then stay tuned a little bit later today when you have your evening sessions with me let me know do you like your evening sessions comment below and tell me where you are i've been wondering where are my viewers from i'm in australia i'm in queensland australia where are you from comment below let me know all right let's see your personal messages time to let them go heal and prepare for the new love i feel that's the knight of swords and i feel that's the process you're going through taurus 
next up what can i do to get you back oh my god they want to get you back but you need to let them go because you need to move on you they'll they know it'll never happen but they still want you it's kind of unfolding into a story and i'm picking them so randomly for you taurus and it's just coming out that this person that you're considering letting go they they really just and that you just want to heal and move on because you got five of cups move on to this romantic new situation however what can you they do to get you back they know it will ha never happen but they still want you if only they met you sooner your finances will improve with a new venture that kind of showed up as well didn't it one more and then let's see what it is maybe it'll be something really specific for you your soulmate is in the hospitality industry Ooh, are they this person is not honest with you oh no and on the empty moon we're coming up to the empty moon now taurus do any of these resonate with you let me know comment below and i hope you have a fantastic day a spring in your step and for those of you who need healing i'm sending you healing angels of light to wrap you in their loving wings and to assist you in this journey because i know a lot of you have been writing to me saying that you need healing that you're going through some traumatic situation so i do send you healing prayers okay all right taurus i will see you again a little later this afternoon hit that notification bell so you don't miss out and as always i send you love bye for now